Well, this is the screen where most of the production takes place uh, during a, a live show for me. Uh, up at the top here, you see the M Airlist uh, clip players. Now, this is a layout that I've created that works specifically for this screen, which is not a touch screen, but is a USB 3.0. With it, and it's powered by the same USB as it gets its video from, so it's pretty portable. Um, this is the chat room. That's just a, a, an SSH into a IR, an IRCC um, uh, application that logs into our IRC server. Uh, this is the everything search software. It's kind of key because I have set it up. Let me see if I can find the setting for you here. I've set it up so that it is only looking for uh, audio files. You see here, uh, you can also use regular expressions. And I've set it to only look at the drive where I have the no agenda files, which in this case is the D drive. Uh, so that's where I have my audio files, and so it won't find anything else or anything but an audio file. So it's super fast if I want to look for something uh, that a lot of people request, like the uh, Ant song. Uh, here I can just drag it right into a player. Uh, what you can't see is I'm using the uh, Icon MIDI uh, controller to change the volume. You can see it here though, I'm moving it up and down. And I also have the start stop buttons right here. So that's playing. And then obviously I can stop it. I can you know, go anywhere I need to go in the file. And, uh... If I want to go back a little bit. Um, if I wanted to preview that, then I, so this will not be on the air. It actually plays through, you can't, you might be able to hear it, but it plays through uh, the speakers of my laptop. And so I can preview it, uh, do certain things, make it start at a different point if I wanted to. It's quite advanced. It's a real on-air production system. Um, so that's everything, how it integrates with that. And just to show you where those files are all coming from, um, here I have a file folder and this is how I just organize it. I put stuff by topic and so uh, I, you know, it could only be one file in there but it's just handy for me because when I use the uh, live production system I'll add a folder tree over here and let me just go to and there's fifth there we go click it so it brings up everything here before any live production goes. I'll open these up. That's easier ways to do this, but purposes. There we go. And again, you can you know drag stuff from here, open up the fade. Huawei and the other Chinese firms have been allowed stop, get rid of it, dump it out. All done with my left hand on the uh, controller. Uh, I don't think there's anything. Well, yes, um, the Hindenburg, which is what I use to record everything. You can see it's. Uh, it's recording my signal now, and if I start a clip, you'll see it there as well. He's Donald Trump's worst nightmare. Okay. Uh, in fact, let me just throw on the recording while we're at it, and then show you how that would work. This is Yanis Varoufakis from DM25. So pretty straightforward stuff. Uh, let me stop that. Now, when I... So I use this actually for the final recording um of our show and you can always edit something if you want to you know put something in a different spot i mean it's a very very sophisticated program really built for uh broadcast professionals uh, just to show you the settings for this although i have saved these settings you need to make sure that under tools and options you have your 1 to 24 motu pro audio selected channels 5 and 6 if that's not selected with the settings you loaded for playback you can choose whatever you want um, just for editing purposes, uh, I typically leave it just on the laptop speakers, but I do have uh, my Surface dock rerouted back into uh, the device so I can actually play from it if I wanted to. Uh, that's a little more advanced than the setup that I've made available because it involves external wiring, which really isn't necessary at all uh, uh, just to get going in the way that, uh, that I've set it up and intended it to be. So that's that's really this screen. It's uh, it's simple. It's uh, quick. It's easy to use. Um, great to find archives.